Tyra P. Cooks, and today we are on location at Natasha and Lou Kaiser's house cooking the infamous crab pie. So since we're, you know, Valentine's Day is coming up, and you know you want to do something that your sweetie loves to eat, or maybe just something that you love to eat if you're single. So you want to treat be good to yourself, be good to your spouse, okay? <music> Grapeseed oil, cooking, sauteing some celery, some onions, green peppers, and red bell pepper. And I'm getting ready to make a roux with some flour. And in the meantime, the Kaisers are going to tell us how they met. I mean, when we talk about a married couple being in love, this is the picture of love. Everything <laughs> ooey and gooey. It's these guys right here. But Tasha, while you grinning and skinning, put a little butter in that dish and then roll the crust for me, okay? Okay. The real story on how we met? Yes, the real story. <laughs> we met at a homeless shelter. It's not true. <laughs> I figured it was the easiest way to find a woman. That is not true. Oh, Tyra, is this enough? Is yeah. this enough butter? Mm -hmm. I'll just yeah. put butter around. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, no, it's, you, that's you not. You want me to do this? You know I was a chef for two years. <laughs> Yeah, Lewis has been a chef in Louisiana, he's been a chef in the prison. We don't really know the real story, so. I went in. And I fell in love with her over the phone. <laughs> That's the true story. I went in yeah. to, uh, he rewrote the, uh, the contract because the original contract was wrong. The car salesman did something and he charged me too much interest and it was, whatever they did wasn't right. And so he. Um, I don't think you're supposed to do this part. No, she didn't do this part. Yeah. 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 And um, he rewrote the contract, set me up on bi-weekly payments, which made it more affordable. And he was flirting with me. <laughs> True story. And um, I was not in the, I wasn't ready to date anyone, so I was overlooking him. But he tells me. You don't look that big head. <laughs> he wow. tells me, well, if you get the money, by the end of the day, give me a call back. And he, and I said, well, I'm not, I'm trying to sell some furniture. I was, um, but he says, well, here's my number. And he points at his cell phone. He goes, no one calls me at this. No one answers this phone, but me. That's all it took. And I'm it's like, all, okay. <laughs> I made a room with the flour. We didn't want it to get dark. We just wanted to make sure we cooked the flour taste out. I've added about six ounces of heavy cream to this and then I'm going to add about three tablespoons of sour cream and our crab meat which is a mixture of lump crab and claw meat okay and then I have some secret spices this is what makes the pie the infamous crab pie if we tell you what the spice is you don't have to they'll find you in the river but anyway, back to our couple over here while I'm mixing up the crab pie. <laughs> so he's been the silly guy ever since she met him. From the beginning, From yes. The beginning. From the beginning. Oh, yes. Man. So now we're pouring this mixture in here. Remember, this is um, creamy. your roux, your mixture with your peppers and onions and celery, the secret spice, heavy cream, sour cream. And we're just going to spoon this in here, the crab. And this makes about one pie. And... Um, what we do next, excuse me, I was tasting while I was talking, <laughs> is we just fold this over. Mm. So now we have like a little, little lip, if you will. Since it's Valentine's Day, you know, you got to get all kissy with your lips. We have a lip of crust because the crust is always the best part of a pie. Unless it's crab pie, mm. huh, Tosh? That's okay. uh, this, I just. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to put this in the oven at 400 degrees um, until really until the crust is brown because this is really ready to go. You can eat like this if you want to. And then we have here some asparagus. We drizzled it with the grapeseed oil and salt. I use the pink Himalayan salt. Gives you extra minerals. No iodine. Really good for you. And then it's wrapped in prosciutto. You can get about five or six slices of this at your deli. Wrap it up. Throw it in the oven at 400 degrees just until the prosciutto gets crispy. This is done in the oven about 25 minutes at 400 degrees. See how golden brown that crust is? You have to let it sit for about 20 minutes. Otherwise, you'll have a crab mess when you try to lift it out of the pan. 
Okay, so now we're plating the crab pie. Hopefully it doesn't fall apart on us. But even if it does, it still tastes good. The first piece is always hard to get out. So, so now how long have you guys been married now? This May will be seven years. Seven years? May 24th. Tasha, you were telling us when we were off camera about something God had told you about Luke. Oh. When you met, so <laughs> so you can share that with everybody. Yes. When you asked um, when we met and how long did we date, and I mentioned that the first that Wednesday, that Monday when I met him in his office, the Lord just allowed me to see his beauty. He was just so beautiful to me. He still is. It's very beautiful to me. Um, he is. This is the truth. Um, and it's like I don't know. It's it's hard to explain, but it's like um, I remember. After the night we met, I perceived the Holy Spirit to say that the life that I wanted to live, that I could live with him. Not, it's not a financial thing. You, you know what? It was not an <laughs> um, So I was in the collard green dream. Not at all. And, I, and what's funny, I wasn't even, sad to say, but I wasn't receptive to what the Lord was, was saying because I just was not ready to be in a serious relationship. I just wasn't ready for anything like that. Mm -hmm. Uh, but he did allow me to lose beauty. He is it, uh, so beautiful. And our wedding day, I was just in tears. And my mom happened to ask me, why was I crying? It was just so beautiful standing up there. And there's pictures of the wedding, me in tears, you know. They were, she was just so beautiful. I was a model for two years. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> okay, so you were a chef, you oh, were the military, <laughs> and you were a model. Don't forget the dermatologist. <laughs> don't forget that one. <laughs> not officially a dermatologist. I was just in medical school. That's it. That's medical it. Medical school. Okay. He well, keeps up with them. Let's hear, let's hear about the crab pie. <laughs> This I'm is excited. I cannot wait really to go good. in. Yeah. This is my favorite. I am spoiled. I must try this. Grace is going to get my I didn't have to pay for it. That's what makes it even better. Mm. Mm. There's a bunch of the body crash. This is really good. Have I said that? It is. Even the crust. No. It's always so crunchy. You just got to give me a minute. I'm sorry. That's okay. You got to be. I'm Pizza from, no, one. I mean, I get locked in on the crab pie and I just can't. It's like, what? What else is on the plate? Mm. Okay. Can we cut you? Please cut it. Oh, he's such a gentleman. He mm -hmm. can cut your asparagus <laughs> for you. Oh, my gosh. You know, the truth is, when he packs my lunch, Wait. he also slices my meat. <laughs> <laughs> so then I won't need to take a knife to work. That's Grayson. So then I won't need to take a knife to work. And what is this again? Prosciutto. <laughs> prosciutto. Prosciutto. Mm. Pro mm. <laughs> That's right, Hannah. Prosciutto. prosciutto. So there you have it. If you're looking for a meal that you can make for your sweetie for Valentine's Day, or if you just want to make something for yourself and you're single, you want to celebrate loving yourself, you can make the crab pie, the asparagus, and the prosciutto. And have a great day. You know, just celebrate love. Good.